Gomez on the drive, forces her way to the block, picks up her dribble. Eliason lifts for three. She's got it. Breezy Williams, speed down low. There is Stewart going to work, and she gets two. Here is Lindsay, opposite side feed. Carrera for three, splash. Eliason, who's knocked down a triple from beyond the arc. Kicks it, Cody takes it, makes it. Page Cody from deep, it's the second three for New Hampshire. Six, it puts the Wildcats up by five, and Gomez has been active all afternoon long. The steal, and the score. On the drive, how about the finish on the other side? Lucia Malello puts it in for UNH. Durant's defense, really your calling card. Her offense has been coming around, and how about the offense for Sydney Watkins? She checks in 55 in blue. Williams looks for three at the horn, and she got it. Right now, UNH has the advantage in that end of the scoreboard. Gomez a part of that, and now she scores in the offensive end. And Eliasson on the break. Instead, she'll peel back. For a second, Gomez, though, down low, all alone for two. That was a pinpoint pass right into a wide open Clara Gomez. Clock winding down. Breezy Williams has to put up something, and she is so good with the clock winding. Eliasson needs to get it over. She does around it. Watkins near poke from behind. Kavanaugh skips it. O'Connor for three. Carrera has the one UMass low three. But a turnover. Gomez again in the passing lane. Two on one with Kavanaugh. Instead hits O'Connor the trailer, who drops it in for two. Yeah, speaking of sparks, Eliasson gets two more. Carrera has a three. It's back-to-back -back triples on back-to-back -back possessions for the Riverhawks. And New Hampshire is going to avenge that loss from a month ago and come away with a 14-point win over UMass Lowell.